He's Noah Khan, and NBC 5's Carolyn Sistrand had the chance to sit down with him before his last sold-out show in South Burlington to get the idea behind his latest album and how it was inspired by home. I wanted to write a love letter to New England. It's a piece of home Noah Khan is sharing with the world. You know, it's a beautiful place full of, you know, beautiful people and has its issues, and I wanted to paint a picture of, of this place uh, that I love so much and hope it could connect to people all over the world and kind of show a different side of New England. On his sold-out tour, Khan taking the stage for a homecoming this past weekend, playing four nights at Higher Ground in South Burlington. The 25-year-old musician from Stratford, Vermont, just releasing his third studio album, Stick Season, debut at 14 on the Billboard 200. I was worried about alienating people with such a specific lyric. That title track, a raw perspective of how the leaves falling off trees and the anticipation of winter are similar to the end of a relationship, but how eventually summer will come again and the pain won't last forever. To see people from everywhere connecting with that and creating their own stories around the lyric and creating their own songs and examining their own relationships with where they're from has been so cool. Storytelling is exactly what Khan is trying to do. I wanted to be able to provide a, ma a mainstream look at what it looks like to be from New England and, and to kind of make jokes about the people here. It's why he believes people from any part of the country and other countries can relate to his words. The children and the kids and the young adults that are on social media are really smart and they're willing to listen to lyrics and connect to the lyrics. Khan writing 10 of the 14 songs making up this record from his home in Stratford. The pandemic bringing him back for a year and a half from what he says was a constant cycle of making music he wasn't happy with. The isolation, loneliness, and pain of the pandemic inspiring him to tell stories. To see people who reached out and said, hey, like, I feel this way and I, I felt alone and lost and I feel like I made the wrong decision staying in town or um, like I'm wasting my time and this album has made me feel heard. Uh, that's like the greatest compliment that I could receive from anybody. Now he's back on the road with tour dates all over the country and the UK. Playing these songs makes me feel connected to where I'm from again. Bringing Vermont with him everywhere he goes. In South Burlington, Carolyn Sistran, NBC5 News.